Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to Broken Sword Shadow of the Templars. We're in Spain and we're trying to figure out what the hell we need to do here. We can't leave, so there's obviously something else that we need to do. So it's either going to be climbing up onto this roof, finding a way up there, or it's going to be something to do with this guy's hose pipe. So, uh, that, and that is also not a euphemism. So here we go. Um, let's try this place first. We'll see if there's any way we can get up onto this rooftop. Some of the leaves look a bit glitchy here. Doesn't really like they're attached to anything. Um, anyway, so there was this. From a distance, I thought it might be a summer house. Close up, I wasn't so sure. Yes, yeah, definitely not. And we can't get in, right? Because the door's locked. Rats! It's locked. Okay, so and we can also look I at this. I wasn't about to go clambering on rooftops if I didn't have to. Yeah. So there's nothing which seems to make him want to climb up there. So. Maybe we have to just get the key from the lady who lives here, but the guy doesn't let us go in the house, does he? So, we can interact with the hose pipe back at the tap, so I'm thinking that might be what we're going to have to do. It's the only other thing we can do, really. We've tried speaking to him, and that didn't help us out at all. We can't go into the door because he turns around and tells us off. So, it's going to have to be something to do with this, isn't it? What happens if we try to touch it again? I didn't like the idea of carrying 30 yards of hose around me, so I left it alone. That's right. Uh, can we use anything on it? No. Uh, can we, like, zap it? No, we cannot zap it. Uh, okay. Can we use this thing on it? We can use that thing on it, weirdly. What's that going to do? Is it going to, like, block the water or something? Oh, yeah, it is. Look. Ah. <laughs> He's not my happy about that. Oh, no. Yeah? See, my horse never stops. Well, I'm sorry to hear it. It's always sad when an old tradition comes to an end. Did you have anything to do with it? No. Well, I'm shocked. I'm mortified. How could you think such a thing? <laughs> Very easily, senor. Very easily. I'm going to find out why my horse has stopped. And that means going into the house. You are not, absolutely not, to go in the house. Yeah, we won't do that. If you do go in the house, I will set the dogs on you. Uh, well, I mean, setting the dogs on us doesn't sound very fun, does it? Do, do we want to risk it? Yeah, let's just risk it. Let's see. What's the worst that could happen, right? Okay, he's over there. Can we... Do we... We don't have, like, a time limit or anything here. Do... Oh, God! I think that's where the dogs are. Oh, we can hide behind hey, there! You. I know you are there, American. I'm not. All right, you dogs. I'm coming. I'm, I'm not here. I'm not here, trust me. I'm... There's, there's nobody here. Can we? Can we? No, we can't. All right. Can we do anything to this while he's gone? It was just a little utility room with no exit, unless no. you counted the window, and I didn't. Right. So that's the window, right? It was right? a small mirror hanging over the sink. Oh, it's a mirror. The scum in the sink. It looked like he shaved there. Ugh. Okay. Um, should we just go upstairs? <laughs> he can't get us if we're up. Oh, it's the lady. Madre de Who are you? My name's George Stobart. I'm sorry to burst in like this. You must leave at once. You're not wanted here. Please, if you just listen a minute. Very well. State your business, Senor Stobart. Well, she's going to listen to us at least. There's That's a good thing. There's been a series of murders, part of some conspiracy. Anyway, the trail led me here. Here? There is nothing for the outside world here. Over 600 years ago there was. What do you mean? This whole thing ties in somehow with the Knights Templar. The Knights Templar are dust. They had a secret that was so important, they went to a lot of trouble to hide it. I do not see what this has to do with my family. Your family had a strong connection with the Templars, right? I believe that they have planted some clues here. <laughs> Why should I believe a, a complete stranger who barges into my home? Fair. Just Fair point. Just let me have a look around. If I find nothing, 
Uh, you'll be spending the night at the police station. <laughs> Okay. Very well. Please, sit down. Oh, nice. Oh, we can ask questions and show her things. All right, so it's going to be something to do with that house in the garden, right? I know your family is involved with the Templars, but I don't know how. You should be asking how my family were involved, Senor Stobart. Technicalities. The Templars ceased to exist centuries ago. And as for the De Vasconcelos, the line dies with me. Ah. I'm sorry. Don't be. Okay, whatever happened, happened almost 700 years ago. So, if the Templars left any clues, they're going to be in stuff that dates back to the early 14th century. Obviously. So, what do you have around here that's early medieval? Early medieval. Let me think. Well, the house is relatively modern, a scant three centuries old. Right. Or, of course, the chess set. That chess set is over 600 years old? What? It must be worth a fortune. Indeed it is. Not that I would part with it, of course. No, I wouldn't either. Uh, that's the sort of thing that gets handed down to your children. Really, George? Sorry. Its value is less than you might think. The set is not complete. One of the pieces is a modern replacement. Oh. As to the original, it was lost a long time ago. Nobody has any idea where it is? No. The children had it when they were taken. Children? What children? All in good time, Senor Stobart. Okay, I wonder if the the missing piece is relevant in some way then. Let's ask a bit more. Also, this looks like the Templar symbol, right? May I examine the chess set? Certainly. But do not move any of the pieces. Okay, oh, okay. thanks. Right, we're not allowed to move any of the pieces. Close up, the modern piece stood out like a sore thumb. There was something else odd about the set. All of the original pieces had irregular bases. Interesting. My lady, I have to warn you, there's a... Hello, it's us. You? Why, I feed you to the dogs. No, Lopez, right. what have I told you about feeding intruders to the dogs? <laughs> but my lady, never without my permission. But it's not a never ever then. Then you have If I find that you're wasting my time, you will be fed to the dogs. Wow. Now, I want to show you something interesting. Follow me. Well, that was... A rather quick transition. <laughs> okay. Not even a fade or anything, just suddenly there. Lopez, unlock the door, por favor. Come on, Lopez, you know you want to do it for us. This is the only remaining structure on the estate contemporary with the Templars. Okay. Nice. What is it, a summer house? A mausoleum, Senor Stoban. Oh. Come with me. Interesting. Hey, senor. Yeah? I do not know what you have told my lady to be shown these favors, but I do not trust you. Fair enough. You've got nothing to worry about. Aren't you coming in? No, the dead do not interest me. My garden is a living thing. I will be there. I get that. Okay, we're going in. Wow, this is old. It's surprisingly it clean. Constructed in the 13th century. As the final resting place for the Devas Concello Templars. It's well maintained. These are my ancestors, and they deserve respect. I come here at least once a week to say a prayer for them. Mind if I have a look around? Uh, by all means. Right, let's have a look around then. Uh, so, uh, Countess's chessboard dates back to that era as well. There's something odd about the chess pieces, so we're going to have to figure out what's odd about the chess pieces, right? Uh, we don't seem to be able to enter. Huh, there's a window up there and it's open. Hanging from the ceiling was a huge yellowed candle. It looked really old and had never been lit. Okay. Uh, so that we the can look at this one. contained five tombs for five of the Knights Templar, man size in marble. They look very similar to the ones in um, Montfasson, don't they? So. Let's, ooh, there's something here we can pick up. Oh, what's this stick? On removing the Bible, I found a pattern on the lectern top. Hey, it's a checkerboard. Ooh, interesting. Close up, I could see that the pattern was made up of glass squares over a checkerboard pattern. Is it a chessboard? Maybe we've got to use the chess pieces. I couldn't climb up there without breaking something. What's, what, can we do anything with this? 
Now what? There was nothing to snuff. Feeling like an idiot, I put it down again. Okay. What's this? A big statuette of the Virgin Mary kept an eye on the place. Okay, so it's a chess up, board, is it? I could see that the pattern was made up of glass squares over a checkerboard pattern. So I wonder if we've got to do something with those chess pieces here then. Um, okay, so that's obviously how we get out onto the roof. But how do we climb up there? Hmm, okay. This looks open as well. It's weird that there's nothing here. It's almost like something was moved from here. Let's let's speak to her and see if she can tell us anything more. May I ask you something? Uh, you may ask. Oh, okay. There's lots we can ask about. Who exactly are these people? My ancestors. These five men were all members of the Templar. Five ancestors in the Order. You must be very proud. Not five. Six. Yeah. Where's the sixth Thought so. He's gone. He was lost. You lost an ancestor? It is a family matter. It can have no relevance. Mm. Well, it's connected with the curse of the Devasconcellos, isn't it? Yes, it is. I hope you will honor my desire not to talk about it. Okay, well, I'll leave it for now. This has got to be linked to the, the other statues, right? Is the Virgin Mary really the right person to be sharing a mausoleum with five knights? You are showing your ignorance, Senor Stobart. The Templars were dedicated to the Virgin Mary. Okay. What's the story with the glass chessboard? Glass chessboard? Oh, the pattern on the lectern. Purely decorative, I'm sure. There are pieces of glass missing from it. Oh, it has been like that since I was a girl. Oh, there's got to be a reason for that, right? The gaps in the glass chessboard look awfully deliberate. No, it is ridiculous. What possible significance can it have? It's part of a chessboard, and the gaps are for... Senor Stobart. You cannot mean... This place was built for the Templars. Your chess set is as old as the Templars. It's kind of suggestive, isn't it? Mm. I think this must be it. This is what the manuscript is pointing to. This is extraordinary. So what do we do? Do we have to play chess or something? Am I to understand that the Templars left a puzzle here? And in all of this time we failed to realize that there was a puzzle? It was wonderful to watch the Countess change before my eyes. Right! Well, no time for wallowing in self-pity, eh, Senor Stobart? This mystery has had a good long run, but it ends here and now. Nice. All those years of fatalism were falling away from her. Lopez! Lopez! Put that hold down and listen! Go to the house and get my chest set! Yes! The old chest set! Yeah, Lopez. Go and do what you're now told. Hurry! Am I? This is exciting, is it not? Don't yeah. Be too excited. I, this could be a blind alley. It's not. Oh, I do not believe that for a moment. It's good to see you happy. Happy? <laughs> you know, I think I am. All right. Let's ask about this while we're waiting while for Lopez. We're waiting, I'd really like to know what happened here. I mean, the curse and everything. It all began at the time of the dissolution of the Templar. Don Carlos had already left their ranks to become a scholar. Don Carlos? Is he the guy who went missing? Si. Uh, but he had reckoned without the local bishop. The bishop envied us our lands and determined to use the papal edict as an excuse to destroy us. Don Carlos was on one of his scholarly journeys when the Inquisition arrived. When Don Carlos returned, it was to find his loyal manservant slain and his children gone. They took the kids? But why? Oh, we will never know. The bishop denied all knowledge of the children's disappearance. But huh. witnesses had seen his men kill the servant who had been charged to protect them. What happened to Don Carlos? Uh, he swore he'd find his children if he had to go to the edge of the world. He put on his armor and took up his sword and shield and rode out alone. He was never seen again. Damn. Okay, he's here, finally. Took your time. Ah, Lopez. You have the pieces. 
Si, sí, my lady, as you asked. Por favor, Senor Stobart, would you be so kind? My lady. Calm yourself, Lopez. I believe Senor Stobart's motives are pure. Very well, my lady. And I'm over, Lopez. My lady seems to trust you. But you don't. No, Senor. Thank you, anyway. Right, so we're going to have to... So we've got the pieces. It fits, Senor Stobart. It fits. Oh, does the board just Working go on quickly, it? I found which pieces went into which holes. Each chess piece must be placed in its corresponding hole. Okay, that's that's fine. Click on any unplaced chess piece and it will turn to reveal a pattern on its base. Likewise, click any hole in the board and it will show a pattern. Each chess piece must be dragged into the hole of its corresponding pattern. To do this, drag the piece to the correct hole on the chess board. If you try to put a piece on the wrong hole, it will then jump back to the side. Oh, I see. So... Right, so there's a pattern on all of them. Ah, uh, right. Okay, so... So, wait, so we drag it? Yeah, okay. That, that seems relatively straightforward then. Uh, can we... Let's just check. Can we... No, we can't. Right, so... Can we click off of this at all? No, we can't. Right, so we're going to have to do this in this episode then. So, uh, that, so there's one with like a pink, a cream in the top, a creamy colour in the top. Cream, blue, red, green. Yeah, so that one goes down there, right? It's kind of hard. Why? Why can I not? It's it's kind of hard to drag some of them, honestly. Red, cream, blue, green. Red, cream, blue, green. There. So that one goes there. Uh, green, cream, red, blue. Green, cream, red, blue. So that that one goes up there, does it? Yes, yeah, so I, I, I don't, I'm so, there we go. I'm, I'm sort of having trouble moving them, honestly. Like, it's, I don't know. There we go. But, like, it's, it's kind of jumping, it's, it's jumping back. Like, I don't... Okay, there we go. Jeez, that, that is um, a little bit temperamental. So, blue, red, green, black. Blue, red, green, oh, funnily enough, that goes there. <laughs> Okay, this is this is reasonably easy actually. Uh, cream, blue, red, green. Cream, blue, red, green. There we go. Green, cream, blue, red. Green, cream, blue, red. No. Why is it so hard to drag them? Uh, green, blue, red, black. Green, blue, red, black. That game, just pick it up, please. <laughs> All right. Uh, Blue cream, that one goes there. Okay. Red black goes there. <laughs> Why is it so difficult to move them? With the red pieces in place, the square bases fit onto the white pieces. I just had to figure out where to place them. Oh, so we've got to figure out where to put the white pieces now. Okay. So, okay, that makes it slightly more tricky. So, have, have we got to, like, checkmate the king, maybe? Is, is that what's happening here? We've got to checkmate it? Is, is, is that what we're going for? Have we got to maybe checkmate this one? Perhaps. Um, yeah, maybe. Maybe we have, I don't know. It's, it's really awkward to click them, jeez. Um, oh, okay. So... Seriously, game. Um, Alright, so... Right, so those go there, then. Um, it's, it's this one, then. So... I, I, are we trying to checkmate white or red? I'm guessing white. 
So where does this one go then? I'm not 100% certain what we're trying to do here. Is, is, is that it? So we can... I'm, I'm kind of confused, honestly, about what we're doing here. We can't move any of... Are, are, we, are we trying to checkmate the red? Is, is that what we're doing? I, 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 I don't get what we're actually trying to do here. Unless we can only... Can we put these, like, anywhere on this line? Is that what's going on here? Yeah, it looks like it, it is. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm very confused about what what's going on. Uh, yeah, I... I don't know. It's, it's, it's kind of annoying that I can't quit this puzzle, honestly, to, to try and figure out what it is we actually need to do here, because we, we, we definitely can't move any red ones. So, they've got to go on this line. Yes, it's very weird. Like, it's, there's no explanation. And the thing is, like, I know how chess works, but without any idea of what I'm supposed to be doing, it's, it's, it's a bit of a strange puzzle, honestly. So... These can't go... anywhere... any... So these can't go anywhere up. It's, it's so annoying that you, you click them and it doesn't move. We can't put anything here, right? No, we can't. So I wonder if it... Does it potentially have anything to do with the story that we were told about? The knights or something? Or is it is it literally just a case of... I just can't... I can't grab the pieces properly. It's, it's, it's very annoying. Like, is there a... Oh, it's, it's very frustrating. I can't even save the game here. Okay. Um... I don't know. I'll tell you what, guys. I'm going to have to end the recording here and we'll, we'll figure it out in the next one. I'm not really sure how else we're going to do this um it's, it's weird it won't even let me save if i if i come up here so we're a little bit stuck but yeah we'll leave it there for now so as always thank you very much for watching a big thank you to my patrons arcades games wayne nate terminally nerdy paul from the phantom fellows lyle and barry aldrich for all the support on the channel i really do appreciate it if you enjoyed the video hit that like button make sure you subscribe if you're new and i'll see you all next time